this is going to be a short video on the treatment of Listeria monocytogen. So it's a treatment. It's on treatment of Listeria monocytogens. Now the treatment for Listeria monocytogens is pretty easy because this Listeria monocytogens uh, infections most of the time uh, is not that much severe. Uh, that can be easily treated using uh, common antibiotics. Now the antibiotic that we can use uh, is of uh, the penicillin type or penicillin family. Now the typical type of antibiotic that you can use for the penicillin family is ampicillin. So you can use ampicillin in this case. Right, sorry, ampicillin in that case. And uh, for the other type of medications, we call for other type of medication, we can use trimethoprim. So let me write, we can use trimethoprim trimethoprim as well as we can use sulfamethoxazole sulfamethoxazole good so sulfa methoxazole so we can use this antibiotics to treat listeria monocytogens and they are very much effective very very effective against this so very effective very effective against uh, this kind of uh, infections. Okay, very effective against uh, listeria, listeriosis. But the most important thing about the listeria infection is that before the treatment, also you need to be very, very careful about your food habit and your handling of the food, because this listeria infections mostly, mostly provided using the dairy, dairy contamination, as well as meat contamination as well as ground meat ground meat contamination right so if you're using or if you're cooking ground meat you should cook it properly so proper cooking proper cooking is required to eliminate this listeria pathogen as well as for the dairy contamination you need to be very careful about choosing good brands and follow all the gu guidelines uh, to use it Okay, so if you follow this this particular things and uh, uh, then most of the time listeria won't infect you. If it infects, your immune system is strong enough to go against it, so you don't need to worry. But if you are immunocompromised, I'm repeating, if you are immunocompromised, then you are having a risk uh, for the listeria. Actually, if you are immunocompromised, you are having risk for any kind of diseases, right? So it's a it's a hell of a mess. And otherwise, uh, also for pregnant women, you, you should uh, follow some. Uh, important guidelines of choosing these products right so that's it and i hope that's helpful thank you